A rocket vacuum cleaner. Fill or sit? It's got a little bit of fuel. Fuel required. What? Are you kidding me right now? Alright. Let's head back up here and get some air. I'm flying this vacuum cleaner. My first vehicle. Nice. The first vehicle. Hello, Darth Vigan here, back with another episode of Breathage. Today we're going to be trying to check out some of these locations that are uh, a little further away, but I'm, I'm nervous about it, to tell you the truth. I've got some oxygen candles with me, uh, and I think we can make it, but... Uh, like I said, I'm a, I'm a little nervous about making it there, so I think I will go ahead and get rid of some of this stuff. That way, if I do make it there, I won't uh, be full of stuff already. So, let's go ahead and do that. We can do it. We can do it! There we go. 900 meters. That's a ways. That's a ways. Is that more paint over there, or is that something else? Is that just heated metal? I think that's just heated metal. <laughs> What's this? Oh, alkali. Okay. Make some batteries. Need be. Oh, this wreckage is really scattered out, isn't it? Pretty wild. It's a trap! <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, it's not, still 200 meters away. Guess I'll take another candle. Okay. That one fills me up all the way, at least. Wow, what is that? That's a molten rock right there, is what that is. That does not look nice. That looks scary. Right, I'm seeing the shadows of something. Some sort of wreckage. I don't know if it's the wreckage I'm going to or the record wreckage I came from, but I see some shadows of definite wreckage. It makes me feel hopeful. All right, what do we got here? What do we have here? What in the heck? How did this happen? Survivor docked next to me. Unfortunately, he docked at very high speed and explode, but it's still reassuring that you might be able to do the same. <laughs> How in the world did he did this get in here? Just like some sort of phase in or something? Oh my god, I'm almost dead again. Okay. Lots of debris here. Is this where my next base is going to be? I hope so. I hope so. Because I am not prepared for another journey back. <laughs> not prepared for a journey back. I need to find some more paint to get more radiation protection. Oh my. Something in there. Judging by the number of antennas, this is either a communication point or a communication point from another side of the liner. In any case, there's a chance to find Normandy and the other survivors. All right. Let's check this place out. Hopefully I can get in to find some oxygen before I have to use my last candle. Looks like someone tried to get inside the module using the shuttle as a battering ram. By the way, did you know that originally the heads of some battering rams were carved in the shape of a ram? That's an interesting fact. It is an interesting fact. One that I knew. Okay, let's see if we can get inside the shuttle then. Oh yeah. New home sweet home. The chance of injuring yourself with the electrical tape is 46%, which makes the dispenser the safest tool for useless construction and wasting your time. Remember not to put the loose end of the electrical tape down your throat. <laughs> the pilot entered the module. Well, partly. At any rate, his brains are scattered all over the corridor, and they most likely got into the vent and activated the airlock pressurization protocol. You need to find another airlock to get inside. Okay. I reckon I can get some of the stuff that's laying around. A large oxygen candle. Good. I'll need those. I'll need all that. Dispenser blueprint. An inductor. 
and something else. Find a passage into the module. Okay. Is there I can a uh, crafting bench here? I guess not. A broken toilet. Okay, and a broken home. A generator. Simple generator for producing electricity. It's powerful enough to be used at the station or in a vehicle. Nice. And a red saucer. Oh, I love that. I want one of these in real life. I'll take it. <laughs> I can always drop it. What we got here? Engineer pass. Oh, Victor. Tinkerman. Universal pass with a magnetic strip and a hole for string. I better take this. It's only issued for employees of the liner. The pass gets demagnetized after some time, and you need to use your personal password to activate it. Without the password, the universal pass becomes universal trash. Oh, uh, well, I'll go ahead and take it anyway. Unless he wrote his password on here. I'm an engineer. That's his number. I don't know if that, that's probably not his. For life and afterlife. Trust me, I'm an engineer. <laughs> yes. Yes. I heard those words. Okay. Uh, before we go onward, let's see what else I got here. Uh, dee -dee -dee -dee. Tools. Ah, an inductor and a compensator. Now I got, I had the compensator already. Okay, cool. I guess we're going to need these to make engines and things. Sounds really cool. Super excited about that. Uh, what else did I get? Uh, a beef grenade. Burn a patty is one of the most popular outdoor games among kids. Okay. <clears throat> Interesting. Works on almost the same principle to help open locked doors, break robots, or destroy robots. Oh, well, I guess I'll need to find a door to blow open with this beef grenade. Huh? Perhaps. Or explosives. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Is there any glass I can collect in here? Pow. Oh, blech. Don't, don't look at that. Okay. I guess out among us here. Oops. Let's see what we got. See if we can get our grabber here. Oh, that's a drill. I'm not going to worry about it at the moment. Anyway, in here. Anyway. In this module via this place. Doesn't look like it. So maybe we have to go down deeper. I wonder if these communication dishes can help me out in any way. Scan it or something? No. I'll check them all out eventually. Right now, I just want to find another place with air. There's a couple of modules here, it's like hangar bays of some sort. This is another shuttle, but it's wrecked. I might have to head back up. Yes, I know. I might have to head back up. Oh, there's there's a hatch right there, right over my head. Look up, dummy. The service airlock. To be more precise, this was the service airlock. Unfortunately, now it's gone. But if you scan how its system works and get the necessary tools, we could try to repair it to depressurize the doors. Uh, I just need that shuttle. Where's that shuttle at? Oh no. I'm I'm lost. I'm lost amongst the debris. Oh, there's that tape. That's how you get down here. The, the short way, not the long way that I took. Oh god, I'm gonna have to use a candle. That's stupid. <laughs> That's stupid of me. Uh, okay, well, now that I've used a candle, I might as well go on in. This way. Anything I can do with this? Resin supply. What do I need resin for? And almost ready to use fuel. Okay. Interesting. What we got here? Reconstruct scan. 
I need a construction kit. And a dispenser required. Okay. A construction kit and a dispenser required. Alright. What does that mean? Well, good question. Construction kit and a dispenser required. What kind of dispenser? What are we talking about here? I don't know. You're the one that said it. Shut up. Don't talk to me. I'm thinking. I wish there was a, con <laughs> a table in here to make stuff. Uh, sure would be a lot easier. Oh, what is this? Tomb Rider. <laughs> it's not to be played by children under 12. This game is for real body positive men who don't use stupid deodorants. <laughs> uh, Larian Kroftovic. The game has received many awards and positive reviews for its cultural contribution, for promoting goodness, for a bribe, and for something else that's not related to girl, terrible gameplay. Hilarious. Okay. So I guess they were trying to... Okay, cool. So I need a dispenser, which I can now make, apparently. Uh, dispenser. Yes. An ergonomic handle, tape tension control to dispense, I guess, tape. Okay, well, that'd, that'd be nice if I could make one. If I weren't stuck here. Can I drink some of this water and head back? to the shuttle. I guess that's what we're going to have to do. I guess we're going to fly through this way. There's Because there's no indications of any other direction I can go. That's faster Both than... these antennas are spares and communications can work without them. In hopes that I can... Oh my. Apparently there was a survivor here. Temporarily. Let's go check it out. Oh, that's pretty far. Okay, that's fine. We can do it. We can do this. During the explosion of the bridge, I managed to take measurements of your body to order a coffin, but it didn't come in handy after all. I'd like to know, you're in great shape. Keep it up. You're almost not so fat. <laughs> almost not so fat. Nice. Ugh. Well, what's this all about? But Unfortunately, the skillful engineer turned out to be a less skillful driver. Patched underpants. Okay. Oh, ugh. Ugh, gross. A miracle of engineering. This vacuum cleaner flew fast, but not for too long. Pull out from the stone. A rocket vacuum cleaner. Fill or sit? It's got a little bit of fuel. Fuel required. What? Are you kidding me right now? Alright. Let's head back up here and get some air. I'm flying this vacuum cleaner. My first vehicle. Nice. The first vehicle. Oh, this is really nice. This is really nice. How do you make fuel? I don't know. Whoops. Don't, don't get my bike lost. Get in there. There we go. Alright, cool. Well, I have my first... Uh, what is this? I didn't see this. Girl on a rocket. Oh my, Santa girl. <laughs> Cosmonics day. Okay. Cosmonautics day. Alright, let's go back and... Hold on, hold on. I want to see what I need to make fuel. Probably resin and something. Fuel, fuel, fuel. Okay, I think there's resin. I don't know what I need to get fuel from resin. A breathage energy core. Ah, need metal and resin. Okay. I mean, I knew I got some of them, but sometimes you're getting so many notifications, you're like, what's going on? Let me get some of this stuff uh, queued up here. There we go. I am going to try to fly this thing back to our other shuttle. And see what we can find here. This is awesome. 
by the way. Ow. But first I'm gonna check out all the rest of this wreckage. What else we can find down here? Maybe find a shawarma. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Is this aluminum? Yep. Blueprints. Oh yeah. An unknown engineer. Okay. And then he died. Okay. Good job. Good job making it at least. Before you died. Tape recorder. Okay. Lots of good stuff here. Something was being assembled here. Oh yeah. Maybe this vacuum cleaner was being assembled. What is this thing? Fire extinguisher. Oh, okay. I'm guessing maybe they were going to use it to a photo of the liner. It seemed like one of the stops, someone flew out of the liner and took a picture of it. Oh, cool. I like that. Very nice. Very nice. So we trying to make the fire extinguisher be a fuel source or something? I'm not sure what he was making here. Let's get out of here. I'm on air. Oh, I'm getting low. Uh, let's head back. Can I fly this into here? No. Nah. Get in! Alright, now I'm ready. I'm ready to uh, make the journey back home. Or am I? Well, am I? Uh, yeah, I am. We need to make some stuff. We need to make some stuff. Should I get some more of this resin before I go? I've got plenty of bits and bobs. But I'll need to make some fuel if I'm going to fly this thing around. Oh, I can use my accelerator on it while I'm on it. That's nice. Let's get more resin. There we go. Very good. Very nice. This thing doesn't suck. It blows. Let's go. I can check all that out later. We're going to head this way because I think this is the way back into our base. Because I saw something tape storage facility through one of the caverns. What's this then? This That's is a working nice. autonomous oxygen station. Ooh, a working autonomous Interesting oxygen Interesting design. Station. The wiring schemes of the steering wheel are even less complicated than in the pleasure ships. Nice. Okay. Scan this bad boy. Okay. What we got here? You can connect an oxygen station here if I've understood the blueprint correctly. Oh, really? Oh. I love this. I'm gonna leave it here though. Okay. What we got here? Shame on you when your underpants show through. Stay alert. Rip pants can make you hurt. <laughs> what a nasty lad. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is hilarious. That is hilarious. Broken mounted oxygen station. I, should I... Okay. So if I put one here, it will... Stay, stay here permanently? Or what's the deal? Repair. Repair tool required. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Refill auction. There we go. Alright, so it's a permanent one. I just had to repair it first. Gotcha. Gotcha. Learn to read, buddy. It'll help you out. Okay. So we got me a nice little permanent refill station here, so that's good. Let's head on out. Lots of tape and stuff here. A 
What do we got here? Ooh, yikes, bro. Less than ideal. Less than ideal. A shark mug. Look, <laughs> it's like eating through him. Oh. We would need this. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's unfortunate. It's unfortunate for you, pal. Some, some more evidence of the fire in the modules. Apparently, the fire had spread even to the habitation modules. All right. What we got here? What we got here? A wobbly toy. Ooh. That's cool. Ah, my inventory's full. What are you looking at, pal? Okay. Well, there's good stuff here. Good stuff here that we're going to have to uh, ski-daddle. Anything else here to be had? Lots of stuff. Oh, my. What's this? Honey remedy. Honey star ointment. <laughs> okay. Distracts from illnesses. Okay. Can, do I take it? I can't. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Judging by the steady melting of the rolls, there was a fire in the engineering modules, but it definitely was not the cause of the disaster. Yeah. You know. Every little bit of the information helps. Oh no, I'm going to run out of air right before I get here. I'm going to have to use an auction candle. I didn't want to, but I had to because I can't heal up. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. I was so close. All right. Let's... Huge dead man without head fly past me. <laughs> Been there, lady. All right. We are back at base. We have got lots of good stuff and lots of new stuff we can make with uh, our new recipes. But that's going to be about it for this episode. We're going to we're going to fix up some fuel for the uh, for the vacuum cleaner. We're going to fly around, maybe get some paint to, uh, to get my helmet fixed up, uh, upgraded. And uh, I might even go back to the original base and uh, heal up a little so that I don't have to use up first aid kits. But uh, I think that uh, we're going to call her quits right here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure and hit that like button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.